Hello everybody, I'm the Nerdy Old Man, back again. And last time we left off, I got myself locked, what's this, inside of a, her father's secret lab. And it was looking like I had a long way to go before I'm actually finishing this, uh, this little level. So, we're back, we found the other page of the blueprints let us know that this was all top secret. I found a plaque over here and it seems I need a crowbar to get out. So I'm assuming, what's that? That switch? Yeah. That somewhere inside this room, it's a crowbar. And I'm not seeing, but there's some papers over here. Let's go see what they are. My love, it is silent, so peacefully silent now. Even after the madness and chaos of the crash, I can't help but still wonder at the beauty of these mountains. I understand the magic that drew you here. Please know that I feel no pain in this moment, only immense sadness. Sadness that I couldn't see your smiling face once more. That I'll never meet the wonderful woman that our daughter will become. There is so much to say, but I'm tired. The sun is setting. The cold of night will overwhelm me. I know I will fall asleep soon, and likely never again awaken in this world. I'm scared. Richard, what lies beyond? You know I've always struggled with faith, so I'm holding on to yours for now. I'm holding on as best I can, my love. Become the father Lara deserves. Know that I will live on in her. Hmm. Mum faced death alone. She was so brave. Uh, let's see all that. This was part of a set of statues Dad found in China. He thought it was linked to the Temple of Xi'an. Perhaps I should look into it someday. Okay, I think this is a reference to some of the other Lore of Croft games. I know she fought a dragon. That's probably what that's that's in reference to. A roach. Can I step on it? Nope. Okay. So, that leaves that box. These papers over here. Dad's collected knowledge. There must be so many secrets hidden in here. Right. Yeah, I see it. So I'm assuming the crowbar is going to be in that box. It's over. I have done all that I could. And my Amelia is still cold and dead. Roth first scowled at my designs. Then he pleaded with me not to go through with the ritual. Not because he feared it might work, but because he feared what I might do when it failed. And it has failed. There is no doubt in that. I prepared everything according to my research. When I dropped the stone into the elixir and held it to her lips, I thought for the barest moment that it had worked. The hour was midnight, and my pocket watch stopped inexplicably. There was a charge in the air like the moment before a lightning strike. For a heartbeat, I imagined that my life was being drawn from me, as one empties a glass in order to be poured back into Amelia. I would have welcomed death if the last thing I saw were her eyes, clear and alive again. But the moment passed. Amelia is still dead, and I was no Orpheus. We will return to the manor and lay her to rest. I owe her that much. Oh, man. 
You brought her home. She's here, somewhere. In the initial incarnation, I'm sure if you're watching this, then you know uh, the Tomb Raider video games. Uh, she was sucked into a portal and became a zombie, and Laura had to kill her. But it was after many games before she found. Might be able to use this to access other uh, parts of the manor. Uh. Okay. Where am I? Ah, oh, this is convenient. Ah. Hi, Dad. So I know I only just returned to school, but when can I come out to the dig site again? It's just so boring here. We're doing all the stuff I already read last summer. I always end up staring out the window and thinking about our expeditions, and then I'm yelled at for daydreaming. I promise I'll be good and not disturb you and just work wherever you tell me. I just miss it, Dad. And I miss you. <laughs> Huh. I don't believe anything was back there. No, 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 not in there. I've already looked there. I'll go look real quick. If that's there, I'm going to edit this out. Okay, yeah, here's a couple of places. Anything? Lord Croft is resolved to seal the west wing of the manor. I try to talk sense into him, but he will not be swayed. And to make matters worse, I believe his experiences in Tibet have only further fueled the fire of his obsession. He's now up at all hours in his study, researching God knows what. And poor Lara, she is so confused. Too young to understand the tragedy that has befallen this great house. My dearest hope is that Lord Croft will emerge from his grief and embrace fatherhood and the love of his daughter. But I fear he may give in to his obsessive nature. That which Lady Amelia tempered in him so well. In any case, I will be a rock for young Lara. She will never sense tragedy and sorrow in me. Only the love and support she deserves. Huh. Now let me run all the way back to where I was. I wonder if I can open that door again. <laughs> now in the Tomb Raider movies, Winston was like in his 30s. But in the games, Winston was like close to 60, 70. Well, I guess if you like Laura Croft. I thought there was a place up here that you needed the crowbar for. Oh, guess not. 
Oh, this is a library. Laura Croft can handle herself in a fight. So the thought of her uh, really needing somebody to help her, I guess worked for the movie, but in the video game, it's kind of a kind of passe. Okay, now. I'm expecting this is going to open up some stuff. I might have to re-look everything. future is to the south, our past is to the north. Okay. Huh? This looks rather auspicious. Hmm. Oh, what's that? Ugh. Before I go, I know I can get through it, but I want to look around real fast. That is one good thing about Tomb Raider sense. And some of the old Laura Croft games, I, or some of the old Tomb Raider games, I got lost. You know, it'd take days to beat a level because you didn't know where to go. Oh man, why do I have a sneaking suspicion I won't have to kill my mom? I do have a crowbar. Incredible, this crypt was here all along. I expected a sort of crushing finality to grip me when we returned to the manor to lay Amelia to rest. Indeed, once the last of my funereal duties were performed, I fully believed that I would crumple to the ground next to her and expire, not from grief, but succumbing to the terrible exhaustion of the last few weeks. Instead, as the mausoleum stone slid into place, I felt a sort of peace and energy. One that I confess caught me entirely off guard. This was not the terminus of our story, and I was a fool to think so. Her body may be gone, but her spirit still resides here, in the manor, in me, in Lara. Her soul is forever twined with mine, and death is just a momentary interruption. I walked out of that cold quiet into a sunlight that burned my eyes, and I have never been more sure. Death is not the end, and there is work yet to do. <sighs> I wonder if he really killed himself. He might have been murdered. <clears throat> That's going to be real tough. Her 
And the Atlas didn't even notice this. <laughs> Not only is he an asshole, he's incompetent. Uh, why? Lara, it is difficult to write this, knowing these may only ever be words on a page to you. I wonder if you will remember my voice. Will you remember the way we used to play and laugh? Will you remember me comforting you when you were sad? Know that I'm still with you, Lara. My energy, my love, it's within you. It always will be. Use that energy to pursue your passions in life. Never let others determine your journey. You become who you are through your choices, through the love you give and the promises you keep. I hope you are happy, that you are loved and successful in whatever it is you choose to do. I am proud of you, my darling. Remember me with all my love, your mother. Additional relics will be available in the manor when the main game has been completed. Uh. Lara, I have received the notarized affidavit confirming Amelia's grave and the discovery of the burial crypt within the manor premises. While I can't fathom why your father would hide your mother's fate from her own family, I cannot deny that any legal claims I may have had on the estate are now null and void. Croft Manor and the remainder of your father's assets are now yours in perpetuity to do with as you wish. If there comes a time when you require assistance in managing the estate, I hope you will consider contacting me to retain my services. Sincerely, your uncle. Uh. I've been so focused on defying my uncle, of fighting to keep his hands off this manor, that I never realized how much this place actually means to me. But since I've been here, I can feel the presence of my mother and father. I sense the entire history of my family and the deep roots we have in this place. I want to honor my parents. I want to honor all of my ancestors. The Croft family may be all but destroyed, but I will make our name and our home great again. <laughs> and after this election, why not? Ah. I guess that's it. <laughs> Well, I guess these are boxes of uh, her moving in. Generator. I guess we finished it. Well, I appreciate y'all watching. I guess the house. I'm assuming more and more will become available as I beat the game. And as y'all might have remembered in the very beginning, I've completed 33% of it. But it seems like there's some stuff to be done here. Like, this fellow needs his head put back on. I'm just going to say that there's going to be some continuations. And I'm going to assume that the house see they've already uh got the hole up there yeah hole up there covered <sighs> the 
This is strangely beautiful. Mm hmm. I'm just gonna look around real quick. Oh, just seems that one thing is fixed. I'm gonna assume future missions in Croft Manor are gonna build off of this. Anyway, I appreciate y'all watching. Don't look like anything else has changed. Why would I need a sword? Oh, yeah, well, I know, uh... I was watching something and they said that there's like a zombie level here. Oh, I might try to play that later. God, she doesn't get to kill her mom. Oh, well. Oh, well. It's a different game. I mean, she doesn't even do dive, dive jumps. Oh, well. <laughs> I appreciate y'all watching. This is going to be a really short episode. I didn't, I didn't expect it to conclude as fast as it did. And I appreciate y'all watching. If y'all would, just hit that like, share, and subscribe. I'm the Nerdy Old Man signing off. And y'all take care. Bye.